Hey guys, this is another video tour with Will. And Nick, let's get so going. This is our camping, oh, well, uh, yeah. do that. fire pit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, well the fun thing about the fire pits is when you get here, this is a KOA. You can see all of and them. And they put their fire pits on their picnic tables. So you can choose cool. where you put it. And then, some really cool things about this campground. There's storage open 24-7. It is because they have a hotel. Mm -hmm. Which is super cool. Um, do not listen to their website. Their um, ice cream is not open, and the cafe is only open um, Friday, Sat Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. Their cafe is called the Jack Spot, I believe. Yeah, the Jack um, Diner. I mean, no. Jack Spot. I'm talking about the ice cream place. Oh, yeah, that's it's, not open. It's not open, though they still have it on there. I mean, it might be website. open later. It might be open in like summer or something. I don't know. They claim it's closed because of COVID. Anyway, this it's pretty empty right now. But and on we weekends, it gets you, pretty full. And also, we believe that you can rent golf carts that they have. Yeah, they have like 50. So, no, more like 100. If you want to rent them out, you probably can. We don't know exactly how much they cost, but... Yeah. So we're going to walk down here, show you some of the... Uh, like the main building and one of the bathrooms and laundry areas and then we're gonna walk around to the beach yeah so they so, have a uh, man-made beach uh if you want to collect shells you can get some pretty cool ones down there we found this big one that's bigger than my hand that was complete so that was pretty cool mm -hmm. and then another big corner is their main grocery store is a food line down here and yeah it's not that far as I most of you can get there and everything else it. is pretty far away though yeah i mean you have to go across the bridge if you want to get to the closest costco which is like four hour more An hour or so hour and a half and that's where all like if you want a chick-fil-a if you want chipotle if you want yeah. any fast the food. closest food around here is chinese and mcdonald's, McDonald's and anything you can find at food line yeah so don't come here like I think it's gonna be quick oh, to get food. Oh, and they also have a place called Stingrays. It's at a gas station. We oh, tried yeah. it once. It's actually amazing. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. Yeah. Make if you want to try some food and you're around here, you should check that out. Yeah. I think they have an online menu. I'm not yeah. sure. Though. All right. So this then, is the main building, which is basically the hotel and shop. We're not gonna go inside. I thought we'd show you guys. Why don't we go that way and we can show them like the ice and stuff. There's the garbage. And then there is we found it. hundreds of golf carts. You guys are, are probably... Ooh, trash cans. I already Favorite. showed them. The no, we gotta, we gotta focus on the trash cans. I already showed them trash. I think we're leaving our pizzazz on trash cans. No, we still got it. Yeah. Still got that trash can pizzazz. And then over here is the laundry. We're near Shinnetique, I think. I National like Park, which has... A lot of know, wild it, horses. It it's not the like. It's either Assateague or Shinateague. They sound really close together. Uh, one of them's an island with horses. The other is the national park with horses. So, I don't know if it's a national park. It might be a state park. But either way, it's really cool. We got if you want to go on like a pass. fun um, hike, I recommend going so there. So this is one of the buildings where the bathroom and laundry is. There's another one up here, closer to our RV. Um, we'll show you when we get up there. Uh, but this place is pretty large. I think they get a lot of people when it's in sea, when it's like RV season. Yeah, and um, guys, if you have any exciting plans for summer, if you're going on vacation, don't forget to write in the comments, like, and subscribe. Also, if you have any cool things you're going to do for the end of the school year, play, make sure to tell us in the comments. Well. And then they have like their own construction team, I think, because they all make all their cabins and stuff. It's pretty cool. Yeah. And then they're, um, they have two playgrounds, one at the front, it's a little smaller than this one, but the one at the front has swings. And then, um, we will also show you guys the beach. That's also where their cafe is. On um, their cafe, we get like a burger or something from them. It looks pretty dang good. Yeah, what? Yeah, ma. Uh, but they do mostly seafood from looking at their menu. 
Uh, yeah. but they do some other stuff. Yep. We did get to try some, like, clams. Oh, yeah. And oysters here. No, we only got to try oh, clams. clams. And crab it. cake and flounder, I believe. I like, um, the place where we went to was, like, um, on... I it was cold. But, um, it's this little restaurant like on the river, and we got to try clams and flounder for the first Chesapeake, time. Chesapeake, actually. But, um, if you want to go there, I think my mom might have wrote in a blog about that, so if you want to check that out, go for it. It's on teppytravels.com. Yep. Alright, so that's the other bathroom. Laundry, yeah. it's slightly it's a little close. closer to our site, but the one up there has more laundry machines and stuff. And then we're gonna make our way. That's a playground camp site, I think. It's pretty cool, I guess. Oh, uh, we're gonna make our way to the beach, show you that. And then we gotta show them the trash cans over there. No, we don't. We gotta end with the trash cans. Uh, but, uh, this is a pool area. It's currently closed. But if you're coming here during summer, it's going to be open. And it's pretty cool that surfboard. They're getting ready earlier. And um, the surfboard shoots out water. And then they have like. Um, Nick's very excited about that part. And then they have like um, little scraps of water that shoot up. It's pretty yeah, cool. It is. If you're looking for something fun, I recommend going there. And then these might be like 10 campus things we don't really know. And that's the playground. They have two playgrounds. One's near the front office. So for everybody that's near there, you have one there, and then there's one here. They're not that big, but I mean, if you have little like kids, or, I mean, it's pretty nice. Really, any age kid probably would like that. I mean, and you and I probably wouldn't fit cool in thing. there. They have um, hammocks over here. Yep, they have hammocks. I do not recommend sitting in the hammock The chair. hammock chairs are not very... Yeah. stable a lot of their ropes are ripped but the hammocks themselves awesome. are pretty good yeah and they're right on the beach there. Going there so relax. we're not gonna go all the way down to the beach because there's a lot of people mm -hmm. but we'll just show you the jack we spot will. and the yeah. ocean right here see you guys don't forget to like and subscribe